Hello everyone, and welcome to day five of my permanent infection playthrough. Um, it's almost, almost day five. So my wheel spin was no running all day. Which will make this day extremely slow, probably. So let's go over some things I need to do. First of all, I think I need some tinctures. I need to treat Anna and Bad Grief today. And they're the only two. So far, Anna's in the lead for infection because her only competition was Notkin and he died. So far, Anna has survived one day. We'll see if she can beat Grief tonight. But let's take a look at my tinctures because I do need to treat them. I have two orange. Let me pull out my tincture guide. So I, I do want some for me as well. How many bottles do I have? I have 10 in storage, 7 on me. I have 14 in storage. Alright, let's take this 4 and get some herbs on me. Oh, I might need to take a new scalpel with me today. All right, so I have three orange. What does Swevery make? Swevery makes green. Okay. So let's make three white, which is blood and brown. And then it's Swevery. And black or blood will make me the plus version of the green ones, which I'm going to keep for myself. So those are five for myself. All right. Put these away now. And I'm only going to need two of each of the tinctures and then the stack of five for myself, as I keep saying. Um, I'll need to remember to pour that bottle of blood out some other night. Split this stack. Leave one of them here. Split the this stack. Leave that one here. And how's the duration on my scalpel? Um, I've got about half duration. That might be enough. I'll take a very broken one with me. For today's hospital. Um, leave the stack of fish. Uh, I'll keep the cask. I'll keep the pemmican for food. Um, I hope that's enough. So now I'm going to take some morphine and sleep for two hours. Well, let me wait this few seconds for it to actually begin day, the day. Uh, I can eat something. I'll try to eat these the two pemmican I've got. Just one for now, I guess. Should know. You know what? I guess I'll just go to Griefs. I'll take a nap at someone else's places. Someone else's place today. Day five, in which the Haruspex fully embraces the struggle of invention and a sacrifice is offered. I forgot about the sacrifice. I'm all damp and washed out. Okay, first I'm gonna head to Grief. I'm gonna treat him. Uh, so I got a pocket watch for him. We'll head to this to agreed for the sacrifice, and then it's to to the willows. And then I do I really need to avoid this going through. Is this the gut? Yeah, I need I cannot go through there. I can't run from anybody if they attack me. So I'm gonna have to make big detours around town to avoid going into any burned districts. 
or I can use the boats. I have a, I have a stock um a stack of fingernails I haven't been using really. Now I can perfectly avoid, wait. I just realized it would have made more sense to go do this stuff first then came come down here. Since I do want to be time efficient because I don't know how much time I'm going to lose by walking around. Instead of doing what I just said, once I finish with griefs, I'll head for the the hospital. Now there is a chance I, I I do have to walk through the infected district. Well, a few infected districts. Now there is a chance while I'm walking through there that I run into an arsonist. And of course I cannot run from him. I hate grief. Let's trade first and then I'll give you your medicine. Have a pocket watch and a shotgun. I'll take this lockpick. Uh, let me save first. Uh, take one of these, and you can have one of these. Okay, have some ferromycenium. Grief is still in the run. So now I'm going to cut through here and to the hospital. Now. I'm not sure what my job is today, but it's what I, if it's what I think it is, I should have brought more tinctures with me. I think today's job is administering correct antibiotics to three patients, which means I need tinctures to do that. Oh, shoot. Nearly ran into that person. I think I should have made way more tinctures. I can't tell if that's an arsonist or not. No, I think that's just a normal person. I need to avoid this infected person coming up. Any play clouds? There's an infected person behind me. Okay, I'll take a tincture now. Any clouds? Doesn't seem like it. This area is also infected. Uh, hopefully one of these guards have toast. I'm only gonna check you. You don't have toast. 
because I want to keep moving. Okay, no arsonists. I feel like I'm seeing a lot more infected walking around though. A lot more than I usually see. Okay, what's today's job? I might have to come back later for this if I have time. Yeah, administer correct antibiotics. They only give me one to work with. Okay, I, I didn't prepare for this, so I'm not going to do it. I'll come back later with more tinctures if I have enough time. Um, for now, I'm just taking any organs from any dead people. Uh, there's a body there. We've got a body here. Uh, that's it. Okay. Got to be careful in case of a plate cloud comes out. Oh, empty bottle. I'll just go ahead and pour this out. I don't want to drink it because it'll slightly increase my exhaustion. Infected blood. Nice. No brain. No heart. I'll take it. I can sell it. Infected kidney. There's one anti antibiotic I can brew from there. Brain. Yes, I just remembered that I passed by a pharmacy, and I'm definitely going to go back for that. And bring another scalpel. I broke both of the ones I brought. Actually, next time I come around here, I'll check that pharmacy, if I end up coming around here again today. Please don't be a play cloud here. Sometimes they block this gate, and then you need a match. I'm not sure if I have any matches. Time for another tincture. Um, I think this area is... no. Is this area safe? It says I'm respected here. I think it's supposed to say no one cares if it's... Oh yeah, this place is safe. Cool. I've got lockpicks. If you have toast. So then tomorrow this area is going to be infected. I thought it would have been today. I dropped that bottle. I might not even have, uh, yeah, I don't think I'm going to have enough space for the food I'm going to pick up here. Maybe I'm gonna have to do like a few laps around town to get everything and do everything I want to.
If I need to, I can I can drop the broken scalpel to afford any space. But if it's like, I'll only do that if there's only like one or two items left in the cabinet. If there's a lot, then I'm gonna come back around later. Uh, money, a fish, toast, and an apple. I can take the toast. I'll come back for this other stuff. Okay, now I'm going to make my way to Anna's. I'll agree to do the bull sacrifice and then back to the lair, and then I'm going to repeat what I've just done and collect everything I couldn't have collected. Make sure to bring tinctures from my home. To the, to the hospital. And normally I would be running around to go get that cash, maybe check a few more plague crowns around, but I'm trying to not waste as much time because I'm slow today. But this one's not that far. That's okay. Take your time. Open when you feel ready to open. I dropped two things. Um, food. I could eat one toast. I can eat one item of food. Um, I want to keep the lemon. I have immunity boosters on me. There we go. That works out. Now this area is danger. But it's very short danger. If I see anybody, I don't even know what I'm gonna do. I just I need nobody to be in this area that I'm crossing through. If anybody detects me at all, I'm I'm dead. Okay, seems like I got lucky. Please don't have anybody standing near the bridge. Nope, nobody's here. Okay, I'm gonna make a small detour to go to the pharmacy to the left. And then, oh, I can't pick that up. And then I'll go see Anna. There's a playground here. I don't mind making the stop. It's a small one, though. But there are people here. I've got six. That's not enough for anything. Um, I've got enough morphine. Let's try to get these needles. Yes, take the walnuts and the beetle. I don't need that. I don't need that. Actually, I think I'm supposed to see the Sabarovs today, too. Doesn't he find another killer today? Maybe that's tomorrow. Or, like, Clara tells me to look after them or something. <clears throat> and I think once I get back to the lair, I should take a nap. I'll take some morphine and get my health back up a little bit. Deal with a little bit of exhaustion as well.
You know what? I'll take the. I'll take it. This is the pharmacy. Should be the pharmacy. Am I at the right place? This is a clothes shop. Why did I think this was a pharmacy? This is. There's only two pharmacies here, and it's not this. At least that wasn't too much of a detour. Peanuts. I'm going to check this cash first. Or maybe I should... No, go into the pharmacy first. I can sell my scalpels to get a little bit more space. Um, yeah, you buy the scalpels. You'll take them. I think Grief would take them for slightly more, but it really doesn't matter. I'll take your entire stock of drugs. I don't need morphine. I really don't think clothes help me at all. Oh, I dropped that. Okay, let's see if I can correctly treat Anna now. I'm hoping Anna survives. I'm betting it all on Anna. And by survives, I mean survives the longest. There's no way she survives the like six days for the rest of the game to end. Save again. Wait, what does she have to talk about? Maybe something about the babies? I know that's the only thing she's interested in. Kidnapping children. All right. You can have one of these. Still unknown? OK, then. I can just about give you this one. OK, good. We figured it out. Treatment successful. What did you have to no. talk about? This is my final hour. Of clay and bone and hair. She's the killer. 
A local milkwoman. Sure you are. You know, I've I've read the wiki and I've heard people say that she's kidnapped children with a circus, but I never actually saw the dialogue before. So I knew this. Wow. So maybe it makes sense to let Anna die. Why is Anna abound anyway? Maybe she play she'll play a, a larger role in the bachelor route. Oh, I think Anna is a changeling bound. I don't know. Also, why do I have an extra white tincture? Oh, because I didn't give Grief three tinctures. I only gave him two, and then I was able to figure it out. I'm not taking that bell. I could, though. I could, though. And I am. Oh, I almost forgot to go talk with them. Good thing I just saw them. I was planning to go speak with the children and then go to the pharmacy and then home. Please load. I need to see things. That'll make things easier. Ugh. Um, can I eat something? No, I'll just eat this. And then pick up the thing I dropped. I would trade for the candle stub, but I can't. Okay, what are you celebrating? I'll cut the bowl. I'll come soon. Oh, there's no kids here. Oh, there's a few. Fingernail, morphine, soap. Smoked fish. Can I even fit this anywhere? I can do... I need to keep the match on me, so you can just have all of those. I mean, I want the fish, but I don't have space for it. Maybe I should be taking more immunity boosters. Like, I shave all of my sharp things for fish and stuff. But I have so much food. I have so much food. Like, I have a crazy amount of food. And the only thing I see being a problem in the future are getting bandages, which I need to either buy or bottles to trade for. And if I supply myself with, with immunity boosters instead of making tinctures for myself, then that means more bandages. That makes sense, doesn't it? I'm going to drop this as well, aren't I? Okay, can I sell you anything? Take the bell from me. And I think what I said is a good decision. Stop. Don't um, 
Don't use tinctures for myself. Use them only for my patients to minimize the amount of bottles that I'm going to be using. That way I have more bottles for patients to brew antibiotics and to trade. What time is it? It's 11. Okay, I'm gonna set some of these infected organs to brew. I'm going to brew more tinctures. I need enough. I need to, I need a scalpel. I need enough tinctures to help out everybody at the hospital. And maybe a few extra for myself because I am going to be stocking up on immunity boosters again. Just, I don't have enough right now. All right, what do I have on me? Um, just the good versions of these. I guess I don't mind brewing those away. Take the blood, take that, take the brain. Everything else goes away. Now I should only need, that's full durability. This is low durability. I'm going to take this one. Kidney can go away. I'll keep the liver on me. Um, this bandage can go away. I need that tincture. I need this other tincture. The tourniquet can go away. So can the toast. Um, I didn't mean to do that. That's enough space, maybe. Okay. I need one white, two orange, two green. So I'm not going to tap into my stash of 10 bottles there. I'm just going to use all the bottles I've got on me already. Okay, so Swevery and Black or Blood. Which one do I have more of? Black. There's three of those. Now I want Orange. That's Brown and Black. One, two, and then one more White, which is brown and blood there we go that should be enough for all the patients at the hospital Um, I've got food covered. Anything else I shouldn't have on me just yet? I guess I'm fine. No empty bottles. Okay, we're gonna take a quick two hour nap and then it's I'm gonna hit that circuit again. Well, you know what? I might not do exactly the circuit because this is. I might end up going to Vars, which is why I kept the liver on me. It depends on what I get. If the last few organs I get from the hospital end up being infected, then I do the circuit again. If 
either if both of those last organs are not infected, then I had to Vars to sell them. Okay, let me take a morphine. Two hours. Uh, I'd say now is a good time to take another pill. Take another Neomycenium Plus. And I'll take a bandage, because my health is quite low. Hunger still isn't an issue. Hey, Sticky, what yep. do you got to say? A little business proposition. Oh, yeah. So that quest... is about um, protecting the bridge square from getting infected tomorrow, which I'm not interested in. I want them to get infected. Should I check in with Grief? Do I have anything to sell to him? I bought all his lockpicks. Maybe I should check in with Notkin's crew. I've got plenty of stuff to trade, but not enough sharp items. I have trading items, but not what they would want, I think. Now, once again, I do need to be very careful going through this district. I need to try to not run into any infected people or plague clouds. Oh, I can't get through. There's an invisible wall right there. That happens when things don't load in fast enough. I forgot to bring stuff for myself, didn't I? I mean, I've got two immunity boosters. That's a play cloud. Please don't turn the corner. Please don't turn the corner. Okay, it popped over there. Now, arsonists are a problem as well. You're a normal man. No, I think you're an arsonist. He didn't want to trade, so I don't think he's normal. But I saw him fighting somebody earlier. I don't know what's with him. How am I going to get past this person? Just sneak past? Yeah, that works. Any play clouds coming this way? <coughs> oh, yeah, see, I knew Clara would tell me to go check on the Savarovs.
Now, I am wondering, what will happen if I try to save Murky while I'm already infected? Will that raise my infection bar by a bunch? Will it do absolutely nothing to me? Because I might not save Murky if it raises my infection bar by a bunch. But if I can do it and it doesn't change what I'm doing at all, then I might as well save her. Okay, let's start with the patients on the stage just in case a play cloud jumps out of them. Okay, nice. Figured that one out easily. Next to you, have one of these. Have one of these. Figured that one out easily as well. I don't have many green pills, do I? One more person. Okay, good thing they're not asking for green pills. Job done. Hey, my fund is pretty good as well. Now, I think it was you who I didn't get the rest of. Yep. Kidney is uninfected. Liver is uninfected. That means I'm making a trip to Vars. I don't have any bottles on me. Walking around outside should be prohibited. Special courier should be assigned instead. Fastest way to this area, there's that. Hopefully there's not a plague cloud blocking that spot, and hopefully I don't run into any arsonists. I don't know if they're actually called arsonists. Maybe they're called fire bombers. That's a guard. That's another guard. I see multiple people in a fight ahead. Okay, it's just a guard and some infected people. Okay, so I think from here, once I'm done in this area, I'll take the boat to Lara's. Just for convenience, I can pick up what I've left at her place, and then I can make my my way to Town Hall. Let's take those immunity boosters now. And while I'm in the area, I need to figure out, I've spoken with Eva. Have I spoken with Maria? If she's not on my list, I need to speak with her so that she's on my list. So that tomorrow I don't need to come back here once this place is infected. I can just not deal with this area. Okay, list I have. I have Victor, I've got Georgi, I have Maria, I have Eva. All right, I don't need to speak with anybody. These pumps are still fixed.
I'm going to cut through here to take a shortcut. Bar always spawns in first. I don't know why he does that. I'll take the bandages, tourniquets, immunity boosters. And uh, more drugs. Uh, that's it. Okay, so boat to Lara's because that's fast. Fund Sabarov's. And then that's it. That's all I have to do today. Eventually, I get to trade and do whatever I want until I'm summoned to the Raggy Barrow. Um, I think I'll check out this pharmacy. It's close. There's. No, no, no. Not even going to risk it. Not going to risk it. Because if there's just one guy who spawns in near the entrance to that district, I could die. Either I die or I burn through way too many healing items that I want to. I wonder if the boat prices have gone up yet. I don't know what day it is and they go up from one to two. Okay, it's still one. Oh, I should actually be summoned to the Raggy Bureau soon, I think. Oh, this place is infected. I could, I forgot about that. I forgot that I infected this place. I wouldn't have done that. I wouldn't have taken the boat here had I remembered.
I left tan here and was it some toast maybe? Oh, two cans of food. Now I'm going to save just in case I die on the way over there. Fastest way out of here? Oh, I have to go this way because this area is also infected. There's a shortcut I can take through here that's shorter. Oh, but there's a play cloud blocking it. I'm not turning around. Be gone, demon. Oh, now I gotta get past this person. Actually, I think they'll handle that for me. That was my only match, though. I'll check this playground. You know what? I just remembered that I forgot to go to that pharmacy by the theater. I guess I'm just not going to go there today. Oh, it's it's time for me to be there at the Raggy Barrow. All right, I'll pick up my fund and head straight over there. Maybe I could take a boat. I can take that boat down to there. Which I think normally would be slower. But since I'm walking, it might be faster. Or I'll just walk. I mean, I, the thing is, I don't know when the deadline is to cut the to to cut up this bull. I'm guessing that it's at midnight because it is later in the day already. I left an apple slice in here and a fish. I think I'm going to eat both of them right now. Yep. What's that about? Oh, it's just telling me I collected my fund. Um, what are these about? I don't look at my mind map that often because I always know. Oh yeah, I need to talk to the Sabaravs. Anyways, I don't always look at my mind map that often because I know what I have to do and I know where to go. Now for one last time today, I've got to go into this small danger zone in order to get to where I need to go. And by small danger zone, I mean this small section to get to the bridge to the tanners. Is there anyone in this playground? Nope.
So if somebody is here, I think I'm gonna have to walk all the way back to this district, enter her house, and leave again. And then just keep doing that until nobody's here. But it looks clear. There could be somebody standing in front of the bridge, though. Uh, it's clear. All right. There was something here I couldn't pick up last time. Was it just a bottle? It was a candle stub. I can afford that. But why did I just do that? I, j I told myself that I wanted immunity boosters from now on. I'm in the fish mindset. I cannot stop buying fish, apparently. Wait, meeting with Murky, that's tomorrow night, right? That's not tonight. Because I know this is part of the quest chain. They're talking about the carrier, which is Murky. She's infected and she just doesn't know it. Shut them up. Toughen up. Leave hesitation behind. What? I wasn't paying attention. You just tell them, tell them to go away? Is that it? I thought this was the time where I come in and then he's like, no, I don't need help. Katarina needs help. And then you see the rat prophet, but I guess that's on a later day. I think I did what I had to right now. Yeah. Um, two fishing hooks. You'll take the candle stub for that, right? Wait, how much do you, you take that for three? I think trading for that metal scrap was a mistake. Because I haven't been able to find somebody to take it from me. What is it to fix one of these? I don't think I'm going to need to, but I just I was just curious.
How's my exhaustion? Maybe I can take a nap after the sacrifice. Uh, yeah, I could do it with another nap. There's a lot more kids here than there were last time. I want the immunity boosters. Can we make a trade? We can. Um, I can't afford that one. I'll take the immunity boosters. You want eight for that? I can do eight. I uh, can't get that. I can't get that. Yeah, I'll take the needles. Those are always good to have. And the immunity boosters. The crude sprawl is dangerous, I see. Okay, I'm gonna, I was gonna go through there because it's faster, but I'm going to go around the factory way because it's safer. Do I need any space? I'm going to get a Menku's finger, a bottle of bull's blood. I, I've got enough space. I should. I should have enough. I'm just going to do a bit of reorganizing. Now hopefully somebody's not on like the edge of the district and they detect me walking out out here. I'm trying not to get too close to the cemetery so that I don't accidentally load into that.
yep. Give me the bottle of blood. Alright, I'm going to head to... I'm gonna go to sleep. I don't have to give this to Dankovsky. Does it matter? I don't think, at least. But I might give it to him if I have to go that way. Let me figure out where tonight's dead item shop is going to be. Tonight is day five. Oh, it's going to be right next to him. Wait. Now that would be technically day six, right? Yeah, day six is dead item shop. Yeah. So for night, so I don't think I'm going to go to tonight's dead item shop. Tonight, the fellow traveler only t sells you the inquisitorial coupons. And I don't need food. I don't need coupons for food. I'm not going to throw away a bunch of money for food coupons when I already have food. So I'm just not going to go. Hey, Murky. What are you looking at? Boo. Um, I can put some more antibiotics to brew. I don't have space. Put this away. This will stack, will it? Yeah. I can go there. The canned food, it should stack. And then I want the infected stuff. I want the bottle of blood so that I don't forget to use it tonight. And then take that from me and that. And then one of those and that. I dropped one. Okay, the Menku's finger can go away. And so can the bottle of tan. Uh, oh, one of these are bull's blood. Um, uh, anything else? I think that's good. Well, if any bottles I've got, I only had one. Wait. Okay, I'll see if I need to eat anything, then I'll take a morphine, and then I'll go to sleep. 
Probably just for another two hours, though. <sighs> yep, uh, I've got this pemmican, and I can have a cask. I'll take morphine, and I'll sleep for two hours. Now let's try out one of these antibiotics. Hopefully this doesn't hurt me too much. In fact, I'll take a tourniquet just in case. So this one is completely new to me. Okay, that took a lot of health, but it also took away the most amount of infection I've seen so far. I need to figure out whatever that was brewed from and make some more of that. What's that? I saw an interesting... Why is this yellow? Oh, Notkin is dead. Oh, this was what popped up. Oh, so that was an infected brain. So infected brains are great. Now what should I do for these last two hours? I don't need to go to the dead item shop. I could sleep for one more hour, but that's not really necessary. It might be dark enough out for me to start getting herbs. You must kill me. I may be of worth to you yet. Maybe? Okay, I'm going to run, I'm going to walk to the Raggy Barrow and I'll start from there tonight. Yeah, I've got space. What were those things? Oh. Oh yeah, you only need to test three. Whoops. Okay, I'm gonna get the wheel ready to spin because it's almost time. What was that one about? You know, I don't care about the panacea, do I? No, I don't. But I guess getting a panacea early could... Um, help out with the fund. Oh, these guys are still here? Well, the torches are. No, they're not. I don't see anybody else. Now, I could have picked herbs earlier when I was here, but... I'm not great at finding them based off of sound. It actually looks really cool at night. I 
I always do the sacrifice during the day. How much more time do I have? About an hour. Did I miss anything around here? There's something. Can't wait to start running again. You know, today was slow, but this one wasn't that bad. Like, this is bearable. Like, being not being able to run, it really... It, was, it didn't make the game really boring or anything. Sure. Um... No, I think the one I got was fine. Oh wait, let me wait for my health to disappear so that it's just infection. Oh, what time is that? I've got 30 minutes. What if I'm wrong about the dead item shop? Sure, the today tonight's dead item shop is the one all the way out in the cave. I don't think it's a different one. All right, that's the notifications for the next day. Should be getting the bell any moment now. And I'm not running until I see the bell. Here we go. The day is over. What's done is done. The night will be uneventful. Keep on working or take this time to rest. A new pantomime is being rehearsed at the theater. Whew. Okay, let's get these dice rolls. Bad grief. Okay, he's tied with Anna for surviving one day. 
Well, let's see if Anna dies today or if she survives. Come on, Anna. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Yes! So close. Okay, Anna survived two days. Anna's still in the lead. But I think that might be just about it for her. And I can run. I can run, but I don't have much stamina because I haven't been drinking any water. Although I can run, it's time to spin the wheel again and hope that I don't get the same one again. Let me uh, start recording my screen first. And I'm pressing spin right now. Oh, okay, we got a new one, a fun one, I think. Why did I say this was a fun one? I don't think it's going to be that fun. It's going to be, I don't know. Anyways, it's germaphobe. So the description for germaphobe is you gain a sudden fear of germs, specifically from any kind of container, which means I'm not allowed to open any containers. Wait, I'm not allowed to open any containers all day. I just realized what this implies. When I made this, I was thinking this only applies to like caches and things outside. But do I make this apply to my own containers? It would still be possible without like without opening my cabinet for the day. Like, it's just a bit of a hindrance. I wouldn't have very much space all day long. I'll need to think about that and I'll, uh, I'll, um, declare my verdict for the next day. Because when I, when I made that up, I was intending that to mean I'm not allowed to collect any caches or anything for the entire day, which very limits how much I can trade because that's how I get the majority of my trading items. But I did write it down so that it says all containers, which technically means I'm not allowed to open my own cabinet. But like I said, I won't put too much thought into it now. I'll leave that for later in the next episode. You know, originally I was going to have germaphobe be that you couldn't interact with containers or doors at all because that would make more sense. But that, then I thought that would be way too hard. Because then, like, that locks me out of every quest I'd have to do for whatever the day is. I wouldn't be able to treat anybody. I wouldn't even be able to go back into the lair. I'm surprised I haven't gotten any repeats yet. I mean, I've still got half of a game to play. Maybe there will be repeats. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick these herbs, head to the bar, sell them and then end for there. I won't put anything away in my cabinet or do anything else. Maybe I should actually drink some water now. I just don't have very many. 
I mean, it doesn't matter. Like, I don't need the stamina to be down. I'm using the same amount. Like, I don't think it, it really matters. Like, I have enough. Time, it's only one. Oh, hey, I'm nearby. I might as well drop off the bottle of blood. I really don't know. Like, I'm pretty sure it, like, the exact same events will happen even if I don't drop it off because the big revelation is that bulls don't help even though they are infected. I mean, they are immune to the infection. But I don't know if that affects the dream I get from Taya that tells me to get the blood from the Shaken. And I want it out of my inventory anyway. I will stop by. Well, this area is infected though. I have immunity boosters. And hey, since I'm here, I can um, check out Var's place for the day. I can get the stuff I would usually buy from them. Or maybe I shouldn't, because there's a high chance tomorrow that I end up with a lot more normal organs in my inventory. I think there'll be more dead bodies there. Which means I'm going to end up coming tomorrow. So I should spend as little time as possible right now in an infected district to conserve my resources. I've got a bottle of blood for you. I don't know if I'm going to come back to see the results. Oh, here's a fun fact. This map is incorrect. If you look at the station, it's angled in the wrong direction. The station should be pointing down. It's pointing that way.
right? Yeah, like, look at that. Like, I think the railroad, the rails are almost correct. Like, I think everything else on this map is correct, except for the placement of the station. Maybe that, maybe, um, originally it was supposed to be in that direction and they changed it, but they didn't change this map they put up. Maybe it was like that in the original Pathologic, I don't know. <sighs> this run is not as difficult as I thought it would be. Like, I have so many drugs to keep the infection down. I overstocked on food, somehow. Like, in the first few days, I feel like I was a bit more panicky than I am now. Okay, what's going for double today? Uh, nothing I have. 
Um, first of all, give me all of your money. Okay, I would like a lemon. I'll take the walnuts and the raisins, I guess, maybe. Um, I'll keep the rest for myself. What time is it? It's three. I could sleep until six-ish. I don't know what I'll do when I start the next video. I'm going to have some extra time. I don't know what I'm going to do for that time. I've, I've done everything I need to. do you have I've got two okay that's where I'm gonna end it for here that was it for day five thank you for watching my permit infection playthrough I'll see you later